What's going on beautiful people, Russell Klein is here and today I'm going to be talking to you guys about how you can hack your photos without using Photoshop using Lwire. So let's go. Okay, so the Lwire that you see right here, I got off of Amazon, I got a pack of eight for around $35. They had a whole bunch of different colors and they have some smaller packs as well. If you don't want to pay that, I will leave some links in the description below. Now these L-wire or electroluminescent wire are powered off of two AA batteries and they have three different modes. You have your standard, a strobe, and then a faster strobe. And it, it is normal if when you turn this on that you hear like this high pitching sound, kind of like those old cell phone ringtones, those mosquito tones, those ones kind of like those, but you might hear it. So that's normal, it's totally okay. Before we get any too farther into this video, if you haven't already seen my five things you need to have to do long exposure portraits or light painting video, which should pop up somewhere around here, it's important to have those things in order to make this sort of photography successful. Because again, it's not Photoshop, it's all doing it in camera, and you need certain things like tripods and other stuff in order to make it work. So my flash was at 1 over 16 power and it was in a softbox. My ISO was at 200. I had an f-stop of 3.2, and my exposure time was around 10 seconds. Okay, we're in the studio. This is Heather. Hi. She's pretty great. So yeah, we're gonna do the stuffs and the things as I look at the camera monitor and not at the camera because I don't know how this works. But it's cool, it's fine, it's whatever. Anyway, here we go. So in this first section, I am going behind Heather with the lights on so you can see the shapes that I'm doing as I'm moving around her. And in this next section, I have the lights off, so you can see the same thing, but get an idea of how it looks in the dark and what I'm doing and the awareness you need to have. And what you can see right here is the picture that came out after that. Now, of course, this is all done with the flash to evenly light the person. You can do it with a flashlight if you think they can stay still enough, but it's hard doing stuff this close. Instead of one L wire, now we're using two, and we're doing the same kind of shapes and patterns that we did before, but with the lights on. And now we're gonna be doing it with the lights off. And I wanna make an important note that you can go in front of your model and get fun effects and not have any issues with blocking them. As you can see in this photo, Heather moved a little bit and that's okay, it's really hard to stay still for that long. A good way to try and combat this is by putting the flash at the end of your photograph instead of at the beginning, but either one really works because you're still capturing that person within that moment. And that about wraps it up for this video. So if you liked it, hit the like button. And if you subscribe, that would mean a lot to me, but I'm not gonna tell you how to live your life. And if you wanna hit that notification bell for updates when I do more tutorials and things like this, then go ahead and do that. And I hope to see your beautiful faces in the next video. Peace out.